Hi guys, James here. Welcome to Tobaldi Goes Modelworks. Now, we've got an inbox review for you. It's Meng, or Mung, or Ming, models. Royal Navy Battleship, HMS Rodney. In 29 in brackets. And it's a 1700 scale, 100 700 plus your series. And it's PS001, so it's the first kit of the release, of the releases. Obviously I refer you back to the Lady Lex and the Big E for other kits I've built of this. So let's have a look around the box. Obviously box art, colour callouts on that side. Three QR codes on this side. And on the other side, again, little bit of history and it's copyright 2022 so it's a fairly recent model um, obviously on the end it's a nice little outline of the aircraft of the boat sorry the boat oh and why am I thinking aircraft and that's another one there So that's obviously tells you where it came from because I had to wait about a week for it from Amazon. So let's pop the lid off the box. And we're greeted by a lot of plastic parts here. And, uh, and obviously, so we've got the D sprue there. And the A sprue. There's a bit of the ship. There's another bit of a ship. There's the deck. Deck colour. Again, a flyer telling you what what, what uh, you can win. Um, the lower part of the hole because this is a waterline ship. And obviously the um, plimsoll line. More of the deck. Sea sprue, which has got the, the turrets on. B sprue, again, the smaller arm armament and the boats. The E sprue and the front part of the deck. And the front part of the deck and the and the, and the screws and the F, F sprue and there we have the deck and then we have the base. So let's pop those in the box. Drop these in the box down here. Obviously, it's considerably smaller than the aircraft carriers, which I hope hoped it would be. Um, it's obviously a lot smaller than the 1200 scale um, HMS Nelson I've got upstairs. Now, in this bag, we have the uh, instructions, and we have a nice little sticker sheet which has has a flag, either straight or in the wind. Have to figure out how to use that. Probably stick it on some tin foil when I rig, rig, rig it. So the first uh, bit has the history of the the history of the uh, the Nelson Rod, Rodney. Sorry. I'm going to make make several mistakes because I'm going to refer it to the 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 Nelson as the Nelson and the Rodney were pretty much identical. So obviously this one has a fairly straightforward colour. Um, Let's see what MC five hundred two is. Uh, 
502 is silver. Going up. Admiralty light grey. So that's MC295. So I'll have to look and see what the colours are on paint. So she looks like that. On the deck. And then this part has the instructions. So they should be what we're, we're used to. So obviously you have the two options here. Yeah. Waterline, full hull option. Obviously building up the uh, lower hull, if you're gonna fit it. Obviously, because this is a push fit kit, you can. You can clip it on and then take it off when you're doing your diorama. B, building up the decks, like so. W has a bit of states that this water line on this one. Um, part four, main director tower. Got two of those to build. Obviously, the bridge you're building up there. It states you've got to put one of those on there. Again, you've got to assemble it this in this this way. It's very confu very uh, confusing. Then part six. You've got the funnel assembly. Building up the funnel. Again, putting on the ladders and all, all, all the gubbins here. It tends to make it fairly straightforward. Oh, I missed out the deck bit, didn't I, you donut? There we go. Sorry, scrap that, I missed out the deck. There we go. Putting the deck on. Um, part seven. Attaching the super, super structure. Part eight. Um, attaching the superstructure too. So this is where you've got to put, put in, you're putting all those bits on. Part nine, attaching the boats. And obviously put building up the deck, putting on, on the deck guns. And on this side, we've got part eleven. Part 10, which is attaching main director tower. That's the one at the back. Part 11, attaching the main anchor and obviously the cra various cranes there. Part 12, main turrets. You're building three of them. Because the uh, uh, Rodney and the Nelson had three turrets is quite an interesting design quirky design and part 13 fitting the main turrets and then you're uh, attaching the auxiliary turrets in part 14 doing the four mast assembly here should be fairly straightforward that see so you probably have to use a bit of a bit of glue here to stick this on and part 15, attaching the anti-aircraft guns, big pom-poms. Obviously fitting the full mast in part 17. And then you finish the ship. Obviously you can add rigging, it's optional. Obviously look at a ref your reference books like the... Uh, Anatomy of the ship and so forth. I think I've got a different. I've got a slightly different one on the for the uh, Nelson and Rodney, which has some quite funky colour schemes. So I don't think you can do it with this version because it's uh, it hasn't got it hasn't got the it hasn't got the little walrus with it that she had the flight deck with. So. That's a quick inbox review of Ming models, 1700 to scale, 
from HMS Rodney. So thanks for watching. Bye for now.